welcome back to the unboxers and today we have for you one of my christmas presents mm -hmm. and it is the friends lego set that's so cool we want to say a great big thank you to bear grandma yeah. <laughs> for sending for giving me this for christmas so that i can open it have fun with it and share it with you so i've been staring at this um set for a while wanting to do it yeah if you're wanting to know how to build this and you're thinking I'm going to do a speed build, I am sorry to tell you I am not. I am not good at doing the uh, Lego builds um, in the speed thing. And I can tell you like how long we've been looking at this. I think we first saw it at Toys R Us. Oh my goodness, really? I had no idea it was even around I that long. I believe it was But I knew this made a resurgence, yeah. you know, um, the last couple of years since they had their anniversary. Right. Um, there's also a Seinfeld one that I got my eye on. So if you really like this video, give it a thumbs up. That's right. Um, or if you like Legos or Friends or any of these awesome shows. All right. So um, we have it has a thousand and seventy pieces. It is two one three one nine. Um, so far a set number. It's going to have all of our favorites in there and Gunther. So let's take a look at the box. Very cool little scenes on there, and they're showing actual size. Um, cool artwork on the side. The back shows you what you're going to build. We got Phoebe outside, <laughs> and some of the different scenes from the shows that you can recreate. Um, and then Pivot, we have all of them on the side here. All right, so we're going to open the box, give you a look at all the bags and what 1,070 pieces look like. And then we'll come back and show you the complete build. Okay, so here's all the bags. We do have two bag ones, but uh, and they have the same number on there, but they do not have the same pieces inside. I don't think. I'm looking around. Okay. I don't know. Some of them look the same, so hoping that we're not supposed to that it's not we're not missing a bag seven or something we have one two three four five six we have six bags here and a sticker sheet Ta -da! and an instruction book that is super duper it's like it's a thick. book of its own <laughs> so that's really cool all right i'm gonna get started building and come back and give you a complete review Okay, and we're back, and check it out. This is what really cool. a very fun build. So, um, I really got into this very therapeutic, and I really enjoyed, this is probably the first um, Lego set I've ever really built that's been, well, I don't know, We've, have we built any Harry Potters or something? Bec yeah, like the, any big set that's like mm -hmm. that, this is not off of a cartoon or animated thing. Right, right, right. So, um, I think it is so, so cool. And I will zoom in and show you. We're going to put the light above it so that hopefully I can kind of, might have to get the camera down in there. But I'm going to show you some of my, some of the fun details that, uh, that I liked. Okay. Yeah, there's so, a ton of details in this. So, and for sure, we probably need to have it on a, on a spinning thing. But, um, of course, up front you have the couch and you have Joey with a piece of pizza in his hand. He also comes with a pizza box back there. You have Chandler, you have Monica with her little muffin, um, and you have Ross, you have Rachel, and you have Phoebe over here, which I'll give you a closer look at her in a minute, and Gunther back there. Um, it even comes with, this is actually extra, so you can, um, you can have Phoebe on stage over there, or it's kind of like a couch or sitting area, so she could sit I think, or stand and play her guitar. And then they have, this is what Ross came with, his keyboard. Mm -hmm. So you can put his keyboard there and let him play because that definitely um, happened in one of the episodes. Um, the fun part is also being like putting in all these details and now that I'm watching the show, I'm looking in the background, I'm seeing oh, this yeah. curtain, you know, I'm seeing a lot of the stuff. Um, Gunther comes with the broom, I kind of stuck it back there. Um, and they have these really cool lights right here or pretend you know like lights like for set. the set yeah and um i think it is really cool so i am gonna go off-roading with the camera here okay so if i take you down into the set you'll see the green poles you'll see let me get you a better look at phoebe there she is very cool 
Um, and then the umbrella stand and hat rack, which is very much there, and I've seen it now. Um, and then you have the two front doors here, which can open. Um, you have the shades above each window, the flowers, of course. Um, and of course, things are going to be not like exactly the same, but a lot of it is spot on. There's a little service sign. Um, there's Gunther behind there. Very cool with the plate of, um, I think those are donuts and stuff inside of that little thing. The whole coffee machine deal, that was a fun build. Cappuccino oh, yeah, and fancy. With, yeah. Yeah, very, very fun. And then um, you got the cash register and the little seating area back there along with um, some other stools. Oh, I did move. I did I move that? That little table can go in between those two as well as over there. So this little table I'm talking about um, can be moved to go in between those. So you can kind of move some stuff around. You got a rug back there as well. And um, I just think this is such a fun set. So you have the little menu there. Um, there's some stuff around the back. So stay tuned because I will move it around. There's also some sticker detailing on the chairs, um, a newspaper, and they just look like they're having so much fun. It is really, really cool. I will tell you the only thing I struggled with really um, was, let me see if I can get it and show you in the back. You see the lamps, the little um, flames back there? It's like a big torch lamp. And um, the little blade, the little fire things have to kind of be going in just the right direction because it is squeezed into the corner there. So that's the only part that I even had to like struggle with. Um, follow the directions. They were spot on. And um, I think this is by far my favorite set of Legos. Definitely. And uh, looking at um, which other ones I could add to this. Yeah. Very, very cool. All right, um, so now we'll take a look around the back. Okay, so here's some of the back wall right there. There's the um, the back of it. And then coming around this side, this is the door that comes out where that little curtain is. And then if you look around this side, let's see if we can turn it just a little bit. You have Joey's lipstick, blue lipstick commercial. Mm -hmm. If you remember that one, the trash can. There's the front doors. Here is the iconic sign in the window. Very cool. And I think these are meant to be um, fire escapes or something like that. Oh, okay. Um, something like that, anyway. Very, very cool. Look at that. You can even look in the window. So also, this Central Park sign can go both ways. So you can see it from the outside or so you can just view it from the inside. If you're not planning on having the back and you want it to show, you can also pop this piece out and turn it around so that you can see it from the other side. Just wanted to mention that. It does tell you that in the directions. So very fun set. I'll show you from the top angle. So awesome. Alright, so there you have the Friends Lego set. I don't have a bad thing to say about it. Like I said, that only thing, that only little thing is the only thing I struggled with, and I love it. Probably my favorite Christmas present this year, but definitely an awesome set. So thank you so much for watching. As always, come back and see us, like, subscribe, and we will see you next time.